Penelope Paradise helped out by Luna and the Boa, our two-year-old Boa, but going against Sydney Paradise, they had a big argument uh, in our recent shows here about the music, saying they're both stealing each other's music, so this is more of a grudge match with the Battle of Paradise. Boy, that Luna sure keeps sticking her nose in, doesn't she? Yeah, the car Luna. How about this uh, coincidence, uh, Cindy Paradise? Yes. Versus Penelope Paradise. I'll tell you, they were a little upset because they were both using the same music, yeah. and one came out, the other was introduced, and they said, let's settle in the ring, so the matchmaker put it together, so we called it the Battle of Paradise. Yeah. That's the way it will turn out, but I don't know, I can buy on that bowl of strict over there. Well, that's... I never did like snakes. <laughs> yeah. No, I don't like snakes. Especially live ones. Yeah. But that's Cindy, uh, Cindy Fred, I just gave uh, Penelope a nice arm drag. Cindy Paradise from the Sunshine State, state gymnastic all around uh, winter in State College and uh, likes ice hockey. She's been yeah, but look, she, she's not very big. She's five foot two, only 100, 105 pounds. Whereas, uh, not that the other, uh, I think the Penelope's had big 5'5", 125, but still it's a 25 advantage. I tell you one thing with this Penelope Paradise. Uh, she says, uh, when I ask her, who do you love? And she says, well, you know, like in the ring and all that. I, she says, well, myself. I mean, what else? Well, who else is there? Who else is there? And you know, sometimes you get the feeling they're not kidding. She wasn't kidding. She was serious. <laughs> well, listen to that voice on Luna. <laughs> Luna Tuna. I'll tell you, that, that woman, Luna, she, she really, really likes to get involved. Remember in Oakland, Pennsylvania, the bar named the Luna? Not your way in Oakland? The Luna. The Luna? Remember the Luna? She was on Craig and Center. Oh, okay. Right now, they're hanging out in the middle of the ring with the Paradise Sisters here. Yeah. Uh, boy, that's, that's, that's really odd. How to have, uh, I mean, what a coincidence. Two girls not related, not from right. anything. No relation. They're both Paradise, and here uh, pitted against each other. I mean, how often are you going to run into a situation like that? I mean, that is really rare. Paradise versus Paradise. But right now, it's Penelope with the advantage over Cindy Paradise. Penelope has a look. I know our camera to pick up on her face, but uh, she has a contemptuous look for everybody, including the opponent. There's Cindy Paradise on top now, throw on the right. Uh-oh. What's this? She's got a... Penelope's uh -uh. got Cindy on her shoulders. You know what she could do right now? That exactly. I was going to say she should use her weight being forward, and she could take her over. She had a nice uh, hold there, and by taking her over there, Bruno, as you mentioned. Yeah. Uh, she has the advantage, but that was a nice move. If she could have gone over as she did and managed to hook uh, her legs at the same time, she would, have, she would have been able to hold her down for a pin, but that's very difficult when you're in that position. Uh, to what's say, Luna gonna do? Oh my, look at The referee doesn't like the snake either. I don't blame him. I don't either. Yeah. Luna the Snake. <laughs> I don't think Cindy Paradise likes you. She saw the snake and came on this side of the ring. Over at our vantage point. Come on, referee. That's it. Good for you, Cindy. Good for you. What what is this? You know, I mean, it's a single match. Why why should she see that Luna be interfering like that? The referee didn't do anything about it, so Cindy went and got her from behind. The bells are ringing. Will you answer the phone, please? <laughs> <laughs> Unfortunately, yeah, she's in the receiving end of it right now, and Penelope uh, got the edge right now over Cindy Paradise. Uh-oh, look at this, neck break. Oh, wow. Oh, that 
I'll tell you what, if she can continue from this, she is tough because this should be a finisher right here. After a neck breaker like that, you see the next snap. Yeah, but I'm surprised that uh, Penelope, after giving her that shot, that she didn't just cover her and try to hold her down for the pin. Because after a blow like that, she probably could have held her down for three. Now she's got a claw on her. The old crusher claw. Yeah. I thought the most devastating claw that I have experienced, that I ever saw, was by Killer Kowalski. I remember when he oh, What a claw he has. Powerful, powerful. The vegetarian he was. Right. Super the, the machine. That the guy machine. didn't know what it meant to get tired. But you see now. Oh, oh here's the help. Now. Yeah. Luna working on Cindy outside the ring. And look how much time the referee is arguing with Penelope. And that got it, you know, that, ah, that, I don't know, I don't like that. I think the referee is a little bit quicker. Very see frustrated. what's going on. Can't do that. Cindy's hurting right now. She's I think Luna gave her a couple of uh, those leather boots in the back with the high heels, and uh, yeah. that's got to start. Better believe it. Let's see how she brings her into the ring. No, nope, he's not going to bring her in. Whiplash her center out. Now she's in. Yeah, but after a whiplash yeah. like that. I mean, right now, I think that this Penelope, she feels very confident because she knows that uh, Cindy's hurt. So what she's out, what she's doing right now, she's not even trying for a quick pin or a submission. She's out just to punish her a little more. Very sadistic. Something she can hold it down. Come on, ref, get over there. Ah, oh, but for crying out loud. Oh, that was a bad thing. Oh, you know, ref, we took this. The ref was a little slow getting there. Hey, he may have not gotten a free count, but he might. Penelope Takes the fall, the match, and the win. But I tell you, Cindy had it first. Referee didn't see it. Penelope got it second. She got the count. Let's see what the replay picks up. Well, here we go. Now, you see uh, Penelope just threw uh, Cindy across rings. And, and, and you see Cindy comes with a body block. But look at the referee. Takes Look look along before he goes down there for a count of one. There's two. He could have possibly had three, but now she reverses it. And, then she's and using she used the ropes. that rope. Yeah, for a second she did there. Now she's not. She hooked the legs, and she 